Hello everybody, this is Marjorie here on YouTube. Today I have a kind of bookish products and gadgets that I love. So these are things that I have bought with my own money and not only that, these are things that I actually use on pretty much everyday basis and I love them and they're amazing. If you guys haven't tried it, please do because they're incredible. I also will show you a lot of the shops on Instagram that I shop from. So if you guys are interested in seeing that, then keep on watching. When you're somebody that reads as much as I do, which I assume if you guys have seen this video you probably are, and holding big books specifically uh, kind of gets tiresome on your hands uh, or you know it's just there's a lot of ways of using this and this first product is a book couch. Uh, this is from Thinking Gives. I actually don't know necessarily. I know they have an Amazon. They have them in Amazon, uh, which I will try to link down below. But this has got to be one of the best. This is one of the best purchases. Pur this has got to be one of the best <laughs> buys uh, that I've done in my life. And it's great. It's amazing. I can just sit on my bed, have it on my lap and read peacefully and just put pages and he has little stoppers so that the pages won't come back and it's amazing i definitely recommend this one to you guys because it's great um let's stay in those things so i have a little guest with me right now this is my niece her name is Macarena and she is, she's tired, as you can see, we've been playing. But she's on top of one of my favorite things that I've gotten from any store ever. And let me try to show you guys. So this is a blanket and it is a bookish blanket. So let me try to show you guys how it's divided. Um, okay, so it has four fandoms in the blanket itself. Um, the I believe this one, this fandom specifically, is um, the... Um, I have no idea, honestly. <laughs> I'm not even going to try. I think that's four. I'm pretty sure that's four, but I'm not really sure. Anyway, that's the only one that I don't know. Um, then we got Shatter Me series here. And then down here... We have the Selection series, which are one of my favorite series. So you have that. And then you got Hunger Games, which is the reason why I started reading books. And it's one of the softest, most warm, and most, most warm, <laughs> warmest and most comfortable blanket you will ever have in your life. I love this blanket and I swear this is from Fire Nation Creations and I swear if Alex, that's the name of the owner, if Alex does more blankets, I'm gonna buy them all because <laughs> they are truly amazing. So another thing that I have here is one of my favorite things and these are the um, pillowcases I think they're called. Uh, but yeah, this is Six of Crows. So you got Cass, Inej, um, this is Wylan, Jasper, Nina, Matthias. I call him Matthias. I don't know if that's uh, how you guys pronounce it, but it is how we do here. Uh, but yeah, this pillow cover, cover is from Fabled Merch and... You guys need to buy it because it's one of my favorite things. And then another one that I have here, which I actually need to put a different pillow on, but I don't have a different pillow. Uh, this is from Icy Designs and this is inspired by Mary Lou. Um, and this says, tomorrow I will take on all of, all of these things. I will be unstoppable. Mary Lou is one of my favorite authors for fiction and YA books. And I just love it. And both of them are kind of, they're not, I don't believe they're silk, but they are kind of that silky feeling. They're amazing. I love them. Definitely, definitely recommend for you guys. Simple things that I have that I love are bookmarks. And one of them, this is again from Fire Nation Creations. This is from the King of Scars box. And this is Nikolai Lanstaff. And it says, anything worth doing 
st starts with a bad idea by Lee Bardugo, Six of Crows, and uh, King of Scars are both by Lee. So that's one. I love magnetic uh, bookmarks as well. This little devil that I have here tends to eat them if they're left alone. But I have June here, I have Day, and I have Stitch in a little Halloween costume. Uh, I love them. I truly recommend them to you with my eyes closed. Another one that I have, and this is a gadget that I actually really, really like, and this is the electronic dictionary bookmark. Now, this is quite old, and I still find some words that are not here, but nonetheless, this is one of my favorite things. So you put in whatever word, um, in whatever language you're in, so, and then, um, wooden bookmarks. These are amazing. I recommend them to you guys and they will last you a very long time if you know how to take care of them. So bookmarks are definitely a big big thing for me. Then I got another thing for me that are that is super important. Another thing to me for me Hey, cookie. Another thing for me that is super, super important and something that is kind of a tradition uh, in my household to do is to drink tea. And I didn't know this, but bookish teas exist. And that changed my life. Even bookish coffee exists as well. And I believe um, there's some stores that sell bookish chocolate. So. It's pretty cool. So one of my favorite stores, and it's one of my favorites simply because they made one of my favorite flavors ever, and this is Books and Leaves. This came in the King of Scar box by Fire Nation Creations. If you guys didn't get it then, I don't believe they're available anymore. <laughs> I don't believe they're available anymore, but this is Storm Hunt. And I have to say, I bought uno, dos, tres, Cuatro. I think I bought five of these little thingies because I love it so much. Just saying, I might be slightly obsessed. So I have three here. I have one in my office. Uh, I buy four. I bought four, not five. I don't know how to count. And then the other store that I love and that I am so happy that I could get flavors from them is the Simply Simply Bookish Go. Now. You can get them individually and you also have the option of having six or having four and I believe they're also starting to do um, little kind of glass bases, I don't know what they're called, uh, where you can get tea. It's a, a bit more tea than the little tins but they are amazing. So in here I have different ones. In this one that I have right here I have all my Aquatar ones except for one, uh, but I have the Darkling Red London, which is one of my favorite ones for kind of relaxing. Then I got, this is Wonderland, and this is Yulma's Treats. I recommend this brand with my eyes closed to you guys, because they are so good. They're amazing, and the teas actually last a long time, um, or at least because I have, <laughs> I have, 10 of them, 11 of them, so maybe that's why they last so much for me, but I love them. I cannot say this enough. Almost, my ear is itching. We're almost to the end. I have candles right here, which is the second to last. So I have several bookstores that I love, and I don't know, this is third to last, but we're just gonna roll with it. So the first one that I have here is Book No Candles. Now, I've only gotten the little tins. I believe these are four ounces. No, two ounces. Um, and they have really impressed me. Now, I'm, a, I'm in a no bun, no buy bin because uh, I need to save up money for the thing that I told you guys a few weeks ago that I might do. Um, but this is Unforgettable, Unforgivable Courses, um, and they are amazing. Just look at that sparkle. The candle themselves burn really, really well, and the smell they have, it's amazing. 
Another one that I have here is Spidey Sense. This is one of my favorite brands. All of these brands are brands that I use all the time and that I actually love, so I don't have to repeat myself several times. Um, but this is one of my favorite scents, and it's Emika Chin from Warcross for Mary Lou. And it's a white with kind of... Um, Kind of like Warcross, have you seen the, the cover that has a lot of colors? It has the exact same colors in here, which, attention to detail, something that I really, really appreciate. But these Spidey scents have scents that are amazing, and most of the candles are not that expensive, which is something that I really, really like with candles. Then I have the Bookish Boutique Co. Now, these ones I got on sale because she was closing her shop, but I believe she opened it again, uh, and I believe it's still the same name. Um, this is one of... <gasps> This is one of my favorite candles. This is a dreamer and it smells like blueberry, thyme, dreams, and honey. And it says the dream chooses the dreamer. This, again, strange, the dreamer has become one of my top like two books in the world. Uh, but yeah, I definitely recommend this brand to you guys. Another two brands that I really recommend, one of them is very big and this is Wick and Fable. And this is one of my favorite scents. This is Warrior. I also had, I also had the Ravenclaw candle, which I ran out of because I burned it all the time. <laughs> so great for me. And then another one that I loved. Now I used to be a rep for this shop, uh, but I'm not anymore. Um, I still love the shop. I just simply life um, and I definitely recommend this brand to you guys if you want amazing candles not only that very theme candles uh, she does the Halloween book box Halloween candle box which always amazing I love them uh, but this is Nikolai Lansov uh, candle which you can see I've burned quite a lot uh, I try not to burn them because I don't want to get them or <laughs> I don't know how to say that. I don't want them to finish. But the smell, it smells like a duty in my house right now. And it's amazing. Another person that sells candles and that I'm burning one right now is Fire Nation Creations. And this is from the King of Scars. And I actually put the new label on it and it's beautiful. So those are some candle shops that I recommend to you guys. Now... Moving on to almost the last product is Booksies. Now, I have several stores uh, and several things. First one, I am a rep for this shop and for Belle, and I love Belle. And um, if you guys haven't heard of her shop, you're missing out because she is amazing. But I have three from her right now. I have three on the way. Uh, so the first one that I got is the Stitch one. And Stitch, as you guys know, is my favorite character character ever the cruel prince print which is amazing i use it all the time that was my cat sneezing and then the dragon scale book sleeve i almost had a problem saying that this is my favorite one from the bunch simply because how different it is no one i've never seen anyone do something like this so i love it because of that um, I have this one, I believe, I don't have the name anymore, so, Vini. Okay, so another one, it's kind of a pretty big store, this is Bookbo. They are, okay, so, Be Belle Sleeves, she has a custom thing now where you can put, uh, this hard foam underneath this, so it's not going to be as soft. Nonetheless, I kind of use them for different things. So if I'm having a paperback, I use these ones and my paperback is completely fine. And I prefer these ones for harder books or to carry my iPad or my phone or something that I have. So Bookbo, they're pretty stiff. They're not that cozy as the Bell's book sleeves. But I love them and they're amazing and they have quite a lot in the shop as well. So I definitely recommend that. I got fandom sleeves. This has got to be one of my favorite people to buy from. I haven't bought so many but the way she um, 
she kind of dealed the way she talked to me and the way she wanted to know that everything was okay and whatever it was she was amazing so i love her because of that and this is the lilo and stitch christmas book sleeve and i love it so i can finally start using this one because <laughs> it's almost christmas still not christmas but almost um okay let me check i believe this is from a bookish box not really sure anymore because i bought it with another thing um i think this is beacon book box i gotta check uh but this is inspired by sarah j mass and i love it it's kind of more of a stiff one it also has a little uh pocket in here and it has the little thing so your book is secure if i can actually put it on oh my god i keep hurting myself but yeah it looks like that it's very beautiful so a few ones that i have here that i don't remember the shop so i will put them uh in the description below this is one of my favorite ones this fits the kingdom of ash book which is pretty big uh, and right now it has two books inside of it so you guys can see the the size of it and it's a beautiful beautiful uh, print I got this one that has cats these also have the little secure thingy so your book won't fall I have this one which was one of my favorites a long time ago because I used to use it all the time this was one of the first that I got and I spilled curry on it so I had to wash it and when I wash it it kind of lost uh, its shape nonetheless it's still one of my favorite things and I actually use it to carry kind of glass things because everything kind of bunched up in the middle <laughs> so I use it for that and then the last two that I have are this one this is a space uh, print and this one is a Paris London no this is a London print which is exactly why I got it really re oh this is from book Gizmo uh, it kind of really reminded me of them and last but not least I got my little jacket of pins of bookish pins so I have to say that one of my favorite brands for bookish pins is Read and Wonder and they have amazing pins and they always come up with new collections all the time they also have uh, monthly subscription pins thingies um, so I have a lot of things this is from Read and Wonder I have IC Designs, I have, let me see what else I have, um, Brio, Brio and Brandish. So I'm going to show you guys a little enclose of the pins that I have because I love them. Uh, but yeah, they're amazing. Also, I have one from Bookish Steps, Book Steps, and, Bookish what? Book Steps and Wicks, which is amazing my first halloween one which i'm gonna be getting some and here in the back i just have an m for maria and i want to fill it up with um bookish what they're called the um the kind of the stickers that kind of stick on and you whatever they're called so anyway you guys that is it for all the bookish products and gadgets that i love if you guys like this video please give it a thumbs up subscribe to my channel because it really does help me out and i will be seeing you guys in my next video bye